Alrighty guys, just before this starts, I'm hoping I get this poly bag. It's been delayed for a while. This is May 8th to the 14th. So if I don't get it in this whole video, then you guys will definitely see a um a different video of me unboxing that. But yeah, on to the haul. Alrighty guys, so it took a while for all this to come, but this is a huge haul. There's 15 plus packages here with over 20 plus items and I cannot wait to open all this and show you guys we got two big packages some envelopes some uh, medium-sized packages some small packages and I cannot wait to show you guys what I ordered this was this is gonna be really cool all right let's get into this okay just so you guys know I did take off all my information there was information at the top just because um I don't want you guys to know where I live because that would be weird Oh, this one's cool. This one's really freaking cool. This one took a long time to come. All right. So, what I ordered was the Mandalorian Black Series figure. This, even though there's an exclusive one out here, this one's just really cool to have. Because I really like the Mandalorian series, so I decided to get one. And he was around, like, 20 bucks, And not that bad. So, yeah, I'm going to tell you guys what I paid for everything, too. Because I thought it was pretty interesting. All right, on to the next package. Alright, on to the next package. Okay. Alright, I believe I know it's in this one too. Just because, and this one was another good deal. Okay, there we go. Alright, All right, let's grab my scissors. I do have scissors because I'm cutting into the envelopes. Okay. Oh, yes, he, it's a little guy. Oh, oh yeah. Okay, this is the little Mandalorian Baby Yoda or Mandalorian child. Look at this. This is the normal black series. This is the Baby Yoda, and he he was not that expensive, like sixteen bucks, which is not too terrible. And yeah, I really like him. He comes with a little frog that he eats in one of the episodes, or he tries to eat. And then little baby Yoda. And he fits in the Mandalorian tan. So it's perfectly, it's like really well done. Like in my opinion. Like that's a really detailed Black Shoes figure. Yeah, I really like this figure. He was like, he was 16 bucks. So he wasn't that bad. All right, on the next pack. All right, so we get, we're going into our first envelope. And, ah, okay. This one, I got an amazing deal. So, some of you may not think it was the best deal, but in my opinion, it was pretty good. I got a yellow 212 clone trooper. As you guys know, I have normal two orange 212 troopers. This is the yellow version. He came in one set, which that set, that set was is now very hard to get and very expensive. I really just want the trooper. Maybe in the future I'll get in a, the Ahsoka. But yeah, I paid $18 for him. Which, you might think that's pretty expensive, but I mean, that's a great deal. I normally see him for like 25 to 30. So yeah. 18 bucks, not a bad deal. It's more expensive than, than this little guy. But yeah, that was a great deal for him. And yeah, on to the next package. Alright, on to this package. Okay, let's get into... Oh, oh, this is the one I thought I was missing. Okay, so what we got here is a Rebel A-Wing pilot. As you guys saw in the first uh, part of the video, it said this thing was delayed. Oh, nice, 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 nice. All right, thank God I got it. All right, I'm hoping all the packages are still in here. But yeah, I thought I was missing this. This is something I believe was 2015 or 16. It was really cheap. It was like eight bucks, too. Wow, okay, I thought he was missing. Thank God I got him. But, yeah, I really like this figure. I never had an A-Wing pilot like this. So he's newer. And, yeah, I really like this figure. All right, on to the next one. Thank God I got him. As you guys see, this um, info thing would barely come up. This is really, like, flat, as you guys can see. But, yeah, let's see. All right, okay. Okay. Oh, so this is just, if you guys can see, it's just a 
thing of parts. Here, I'll put it together for you guys and then put it back in his bag just for the sake of the video. But it is a Separatist droid and he was incredibly cheap. Like a lot of these, I got deals. So that's why I got a lot of these. And I, it's a lot of stuff I did not have. But yeah, this thing is pretty freaking cool. Um, how does this thing go? Um, I think it goes like this. And I'll figure it out, but as you guys can see, if it'll focus, it is a Separatist droid. He was like four bucks. He, honestly, I'd never had him before, and he was really cool to order, and I'm very happy to get him. But yeah, four bucks, you just can't beat something like that, and I know it seemed for maybe eight to ten bucks. So yeah, four bucks, not, not going to pass on that. All right, on the next one. It's like a really gross stain right here, but eh. All right, yeah, this one I had to cover it up because there was no way I was getting that other stuff off. All right. Oh, another minifigure. Ooh, okay. Oh, and another one. So what these are and what I ordered was I ordered this Snoke minifigure. And this um Stormtrooper... This stormtrooper is an, is an exclusive figure because he only he only came in one set. And that was Darth Vader's castle. In my opinion, I absolutely hated that set. There was no point in making it. Like, what Star Wars movie or episode was there a Darth Vader castle? But yeah, the only reason I liked that set was because of the minifigure, the stormtrooper, and the Snoke was. I never had a Snoke, so it was really cool to get a Snoke. He was like six bucks, and this guy. I don't know if it was a good deal. I paid 16 bucks for him. You guys can tell me in the comments that was a good deal. But $16, I really just wanted the minifigure. And this guy, eight bucks or six bucks. Yeah, not too bad. Alright, on the next one. As you guys see, we got some gold packaging right here. And let's see what is in this thing right here. That was ugly cutting. And oh, okay. We have an Anaconda Far, which honestly. Not a bad deal. He was nine bucks. But right as you guys can see, in this haul I mainly got some figures like that I just never got. He was a Clone Wars figure. And he's just another Rodian out of the collection. Alright, on to the next figure. Okay, for this package, this is really cool because look where it came from. Clone Army Customs. So yes, I did order some Clone Army Customs stuff. I'm very excited because you'll this will be in another video. What? I just gotta show you what I ordered. And there they all are. Let's get that out of the way. I just don't want to show you my info. So, our grab bag three for weapons. Grab bag two. And grab bag four. And then grab bag one. So, what we got here are four weapon grab bags they were two bucks a piece eight bucks it was like nine dollars for everything but yeah that is really cool and you guys will see in the video and i believe that's all i ordered right yeah just the four grab bags but in the future i may order a figure never know but this is just experience corner because i've never ordered from them before but yeah that's really cool all right on to the next one all right, onto a box. So we got all the envelopes out of the way. Okay. And the only reason I opened the two first packages because I knew it was in them, and I was very excited to get into those. All right, and let's see what else do we got. Okay, and... Aha. Okay, so what we got here, that's a somewhat small poly bag. But yeah, we got a exclusive uh, FN-287 polybag. Never had this minifigure before, and I really want a Finn and Stormtrooper. And there's another polybag in there. And what we got in that is a really interesting polybag. I've never seen this before. I got the Scarif Trooper polybag. So yeah, those two polybags right there. Um, they were surprisingly cheap. I, I believe he was 7 bucks and he was 15 Not too terrible. I mean... Yeah, you, so go follow me on Instagram and you'll see all these sets built. And I'll post a picture of them on the Instagram. But, 
yeah, I'll tell you guys the Instagram at the end of the video. All right, on to the next package. All right, so I don't know if you guys can see, but yeah, I'm, I'm just putting stuff over there. But yeah, so there are quite a few sets, and a lot of these stuff I order from Amazon. And what they, what Amazon does is they combine stuff in their order if they're from the same seller, which I find pretty cool. But oh shoot, okay, hold on. Okay, there we go. All right, let's see. Oh, this is actually the first thing that came. This is from Amazon. What we got is the Praetorian, Pr Praetorian Guard Battle Pack. This, so expensive. I am, like, I don't know why I paid that much for this, but I really just wanted Praetorian Guards, because I never got those, and it comes with the extra first order. Stormtrooper. I paid 28 bucks for it. Yeah, you guys can tell me if that was a good deal for this now, but... Like, this was 15 I wish I bought it for 15 but 28 I kind of bought this thing late, so that's kind of my fault. But, yeah, I mean, 28 bucks. I mean, I get three Praetorian Guards that I do not have. So, yeah, on to the next pack. Alrighty, guys, this box is really weird. I gotta figure out how to open this. But, yeah, I tried once. I Okay, maybe up here. Maybe off to the side? I don't know. Like, oh my god, whoever packaged this definitely picked a complicated box. Let's use scissors. Let's see if that helps. Oh my god. Alright. Yep, yep, yep. Alright, alright, alright. Yep. Alright, we got it. We got it. Let's get the rest of this. Alright. What do we got? Oh my god. Ooh, ooh, ooh. We don't want to show that. That's info. And... Oh, the box got damaged. It's smashed. For a freaking set I paid so much for. Oh. But yeah, it's the Inferno Squad Battle Pack. I paid $38 for it. That was... I don't know, guys. Like, these battle packs, I'm buying them late for some reason. Um, yeah. It was almost 40 bucks. It's... I mean, these troopers are really, really, really cool. And they're, they'll be cool to add in the collection, but... Yeah, 38 bucks for it. Alright, they'll just go in the collection. Alright, on to the next package. Alright, on to the smallest package. And all the stuff Star Wars, guys. Like, there's no non-Star Wars stuff. Like, I'm strictly a LEGO Star Wars and Star Wars fan. And what do we got? Aha! Another thing I paid a ridiculous amount of money for. We got the Kylo Ren's shuttle microfighter. The only reason I'm on this, because that Kylo Ren, it comes with that really cool mask. It was 20 bucks, and I sort of regret paying that much. I probably could have gotten it cheaper somewhere else, but you know what? It's cool. I get a cool Kylo Ren. I'm trying to collect all the Kylo Ren's. I have them all so far, and let's keep going. All right, on to the next packet. All right, guys, we have three packages left. This is the uh, sort of big. We got two giant ones, and where do I cut this? There we go, right there. This, like all these, like a lot of these packages, guys. They all came all along, or like a few weeks ago. Some of them. Two. Um, the last two just came today. All right. Let's see. What do we got? Oh. Okay. This is three very cool sets. There. Let's actually get the yeah, small ones. The Resistance Y-Wing Microfighter. This was 10 bucks. Right at retail. Great deal. Don't have this um, Zori Bliss figure. That's a really dope figure. And I'm really interested to see what the headpiece looks like. Never know. What else have we got? The Mandalorian Battle Pack. Really cool Mandalorians. 15 bucks. Right at retail. Great deal. And the big one of these. We have the Resistance A-Wing Starfighter. Great set. I have this figure, but I do not have this one, and it's just really cool. I don't have an A-Wing, so it's really cool. And I'm going to show you where I keep all my sets. It's really cool where I keep all the sets. But yeah, really cool Resistance A-Wing Starfire. And actually, this makes me thinking. There is one non-Star Wars thing in this haul. You guys will see it probably next. Which, I don't know what you guys will see next. But yeah, not in the next pack. I have a feeling it's in this one. I think this is the most expensive thing in this haul. Was that? Oh, I was not right. This is one of the cheapest things in this haul. Alright, 
let's see, what do we got? What do we got? Aha. All right, yeah, it, there were two that she was using. Okay. So first off, we got Darwin Wimp Kid, Wrecking Ball. He, I tell you, I, well, right now, I love reading these books. And I had to get the new book because I don't have the new book. And let's see, what else? And another poly bag. We have the C Force of Wiggins C-3PO with the red arm. It's really cool. It was like eight bucks, and the book was eight dollars too. And all right, I need another base plate because I'm all out of base plates, and this is where I'm displaying figures now. It was five bucks, so I got another base plate. All right, going on to the biggest package, and it's probably the coolest thing you guys have seen this all. This thing is so big, I cannot even fit it in. All right, let's try and get it up here. All right, let's do this. Yeah, this Amazon tape, like, you can easily cut right through it. All right, come on, let's go. Uh, this, I believe, has three really cool Lego sets that I wanted ever since I saw them in their pictures. All right. Okay. Yeah, just what I thought. Really cool. This one, not... Eh. First, we got the Death Star Cannon set. I really want to get another Pim and another old Obi-Wan, so I did. And they're really cool. Alright. What? And this one. Oh my god. This set I've wanted ever since I saw it. The duel on Mustafar. And yeah, first off, this was 16 bucks. This one was 15 bucks. Yeah, I this one has 159 pieces. This one is 208. Don't know what the price change was, but the final thing in this haul. Oh, Jesus was the ATAP Walker. No, do not have an ATAP Walker. Bought this for 60 bucks, and I really wanted it for those two battle droids. Do not have those. Can't wait to build this thing. All right. So yeah, this was the haul. You guys will definitely be seeing more hauls like this again. I'm going to be ordering more. There will be a haul, I believe. I'm going to upload another haul video tomorrow. It's going to be a small haul. It's one thing. But I want to exclude it from this video just because it's special. It's pretty special. And yeah, I'm going to show you everything we got in this haul. Alrighty guys, that is everything in this haul. The, from the ATAP Walker, Resistance A-Wing Fighter, Praetorian Guard Battle Pack, the Inferno Squad Battle Pack, which got damaged, the Mandalorian Battle Pack, which I cannot wait to see what all that fuss was about. The Y-Wing Microfighter with that Zori Bliss figure. The Kylo Ren Microfighter, Kylo Ren Shuttle Microfighter. With the I, I'm hopefully going to be getting a Kylo Ren Shuttle soon. A Death Star Cannon, which I thought was really cool. Duel on Mustafar, which I cannot wait to get those figures. Those figures are going to be so cool. The Mandalorian Black Series action figure. Baby Yoda. All these grab bags, which will be the next or er, the next video after this. We got all these poly bags, which I cannot wait to get all these new figures in my collection. All these figures right here, which are really cool. And this book and a base plate. All right, guys, this is the haul. It's pretty big, and yeah, I cannot wait to do another haul in the future. And stay tuned because there will be more in the future. And have a great day, guys. So please subscribe and like the video. So, yeah, guys, this is after the video. If you want to follow me on Instagram, you can at bflems underscore 101. That's my main account or my YouTube account for this YouTube channel. I recently just made it. Uh, bflems underscore 101 underscore YouTube. All lowercase. You can go follow me there. Once private, once public, I may, on my main account, I may not accept your follow request. You don't know, but on the YouTube one, you can always follow me there. That one's public, that one's available for anyone. Alrighty guys, thank you so much for watching this video. And yeah, please subscribe because there will be future unboxings. There's one in August that I'll be doing because I, if you guys know the big hype for the 501st Battle Pack, I'll be ordering two of those. I saved up some money. And I'm going to be purchasing two of them because they're great for the figures. And, yeah, I'm going to get them right away because I already know people are going to go nuts for them. But, yeah, guys, I got all the figures. Um, I'm getting all the figures built over there. 
and I'm get and I'm gonna be prepared to get all the sets built. I'm gonna post pictures on my YouTube account. Make sure you go check them out there. And yeah, go follow me on Instagram if you really want to. Alrighty guys, thank you so much for watching and I'll see you guys next video. Adios.